Les Reitman and Bob Rival, who Les started the um, Manatee Surf Shop was a Hobie dealer, and Bob started making boards in his garage, fooling around with foam and making all kinds of mistakes. And in the meantime, they bought a couple of pop outs and then decided to get the Hobies and then worked their way. And then all of a sudden, everybody started buying boards. Uh, and it, it, were, it was 1962, 63, Bruce Brown came out, I think with Slippin' Wet or one of the movies and did it in convention hall and it just it just blew everybody's mind. It was a completely different time. Delmar was probably at his absolute craziest in 1981. Pretty much anything went. There used to be bars up and down Ocean Avenue so it would be people walking from one bar to the next bar to the next bar and by the time they got to the third or fourth bar obviously they were pretty crazy. But uh, the town's changed a lot. Ch changed a lot, it's cleaned up a lot and uh, it's really become a much more family oriented town than it was back when we first started here. We pack in the car and start surfing a lot of the surrounding towns we served. We became good friends with the Long Branch locals of the North End and West End and we became, we also started surfing Bradley and Belmar a lot and uh, 15, 20 years ago just you know moving into the, moving out of the, the Ocean Township area down into Bradley Beach and stuff started hanging out in Belmar all the time and next thing you know I'm uh, you know, get in with the locals, and then we started the band 12 years ago with Barry and the Penetrators. And you know, Barry being the manager here at Eastern Lines, uh, it just naturally got sucked into the, the, the family system here. And it's so like, you know, when you're in Belmore, you feel like you're in like the nucleus of the surf scene of this region. So much more of an activity around, and you know, there's a lot of good surfers in the area. And when you have, you know, ever since the Belmar Pro started you know all of a sudden it just seems like it's it's that's the hot spot of monmouth county to me now is you know the belmar area